Hi. Um, I wanted to make this video about a really amazing realization that has, it's a point that's opened up within the Destiny community that uh, is very supportive um, to assist and support each to walk the process towards self-change. The blog that I read recently that helped me to wrap my mind around this point was a blog by Malin. Um, and it's called I'm nothing but a character and the self-forgiveness statement that really helped open my eyes was the following I forgive myself that I've accepted and allowed myself to take on different characters dependent on which person I'm interacting with in an attempt or try to be the person who I perceive others wanting me to be and thus have shaped and created different characters within my relationship to others. Not seeing and realizing that when I am taking on the, this character I am not developing relationships that are best on that are based on what is best for all but merely based on illusionary characters. I commit myself to, when I am interacting with others and seeing that I am accessing personality or character, to stop immediately and delete the character to realizing that I am creating a relationship that is based on self-dishonesty. The reason why this point was so cool to me in, in reading this and having the realization for myself was that when you take into consideration that who we are and how we live, within the statement that no man is an island we don't exist independently and isolated from the whole uh, we exist within um, a network of relationships which start within our immediate environment and then really spread out to include the entire world thus equality and oneness because within these relationships we are one with the whole and we are equal to it because it is part of us. Um, if you consider and think and live this this statement and realization, then the result is a living application that does what's best for yourself as all. Therefore, everything you do takes into consideration the whole as if it were you. And so this is why the point of developing relationships that are self-honest is so important because if you develop relationships based on these characters that as it turns out if you look self-honestly at your own life we'll, you'll see that we all exist as if we're the star of our own Hollywood movie and we have this cast of characters that we'll play depending on who we're with or where we are or what stimulus is in our environment. Um, anything can affect um, a memory, a thought, a feeling. Anything can affect and trigger one to go into a character instead of existing just in the moment as, as who we are here. Um, so the self-forgiveness statement that I just read that Malin wrote is saying that when you're interacting with people we go into these characters based on who we perceive who we want to perceive ourselves as or who we think the other would want to see us as and whether we're trying or attempting to obtain their validation and acceptance or our own validation and acceptance in the end if if you're a real being then you don't need to be validated or accepted by anyone because you're real and that is unquestionable but if you're playing a role, an act, or a character then because it's not real, because it's based on some illusion of who you desire to be or some internal experience you desire to attain then you're going to have that feeling of requiring validation, acceptance, and approval because what you are is not real. And the huge implications of this are the fact that these characters influence 
our relationships with other people and make them, as Millen says, that when we exist as characters, we are not seeing and realizing that the relationships we're interacting within are not developed from a starting point of what's best for all, but merely what's they're based on illusionary characters. And an illusionary character is the characterization of self-interest because we're doing it in order to obtain something for ourselves. Um, and if you consider this on a mass scale, then what you have is billions of people functioning within self-interest, basing relationships on something illusionary instead of the actual reality that's here, and not making decisions from a starting point of taking into consideration, consideration the actual reality that's here. So that equation all equals um, a major disaster like we're experience right, experiencing right now in the world, um, where decisions that are made and actions that are lived out are not based whatsoever on the actual reality, the physical reality we exist within. They're based on illusionary wants, needs, desires, characters, that we play that in the end don't take into consideration anybody but self. So I'm really looking forward to writing out my characters and reading the blogs of others to really understand the whole concept of realizing that everything and every one exists as nothing more than an illusionary cast of characters. Um, so uh, it's a really cool realization and if you follow the Journey to Life blogs then you can read and follow as each one of us pulls out day by day the characters that we play and there will unquestionably be some that you're able to relate to as well. Um, so. I'll put, post the link to Malin's blog that I read in the description box, and I guess that's it. Thank you.